Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this is a reading for the 14th of August 2020 and it is for the sign of Taurus. That being said, this is a general reading so it might not resonate with everybody. So please do take whatever resonates with you, whatever feels good with you, and leave the rest aside. If it does not feel right, then it must not be right. Uh, that being said, if ever you're looking for some guidance, you're looking for some answers, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. You can also find all of my information in the Dropbox, uh, YouTube Dropbox, right down here below the video. You will find the different types of readings that I offer. You will also find the uh, price list and how to get upon reaching me. So that being said, if you do enjoy my videos and you do enjoy my messages and you have not subscribed yet, please do take a brief moment to click the subscribe button, show your support, show your encouragement towards the channel and to myself, it's very important. So please do click the subscribe button and I'd be mostly appreciated. So that being said, um, Today we're trying to find out what's blocking this union. What is going on? What is there's a stress into the relationship and we're wondering what exactly is it? We don't quite know. So let's try and find out. So as I said, this is for the sign of Taurus. It's meant to be short, sweet, and give you an, the answer. So let's go see what kind of answer we can have for you. I have the fool, I have the seven of hearts, I have the queen of acorns, and I have the eight of hearts. So to begin with, I feel as though your partner is very um I feel as though they have a free spirit, okay? I feel as though um, it's a certain, well, first of all, I do have to say, I feel as though this is not a old relationship. It's not something that has been lasting for, you know, five, 10 or 15 years. It's something that's um, pretty much recent, I would have to say. And um, I feel as though this is really about the beginning and the relationship, how um, we're just kind of doing whatever we want to do is pretty much what it is. This is what I feel that your partner is doing. They're just going around doing what they want to do. They love you. And that is no, there's, there's no doubt there. But, you know, they're going around and they're more thinking about themselves, doing the little things. It's all about innocence, beginnings. A, a great free spirit is really what I'm seeing here, okay? So this person here is completely, I feel as though your partner doesn't really see anything. Everything is fine. I think everything seems fine for your partner. I feel as though you're the one who has a blockage. Um, what the blockage may be, different little possibilities here, okay? So I have over here with the Queen of Acorns. Now the Queen of Acorns is really, um, it's really about your love, okay? This is a need for love and appreciation in your life. I feel as though you don't have that need for love. You don't have that appreciation that you want because you know, your partner is a little bit independent, maybe a little bit too much independent. But that being said, they don't necessarily, um, perhaps you'd like them to be more attached, more around you all the time, closer, have some more time together. But that being said, this is what you're meaning. This is what you're lacking. You're lacking the need of appreci appreciation in your life and of love. So this is a blocking to begin with. I do see a second blocking. Um, Another blocking is all about the wishful thinking. I feel as though there's a lot of wishful thinking here on your behalf, uh, perhaps of just things that you would like because you don't have exactly what you want. You don't have all that love that you want. You don't have all that appreciation that you want. And so I feel as though you, um, you want this. And so when you want something but you don't have it, what do we do? We dream, we wish, we create ourselves illusions to feed our soul, to feed our heart, to feed our mind, to feel whatever emptiness we have inside. And I feel as though this is what is going on right now into this relationship. And, um, you know, and over here, I feel as though at the very, I feel as though this relationship is just maybe the relationship also because you have these needs that are not quite being met for yourself okay I'm not saying they're not giving you any loving I'm saying you're not getting the loving that you want to have and um, so you're creating yourself some illusions they're quite free-spirited and I feel as though you're just going to um, I feel as though this relationship is just not as important as you think it might be and I think this might be coming from the partner I think they're in it and they're having fun and it's it's great and they're happy like that they are happy but I feel as though perhaps you might not have the same goals and so that is to be communicated uh, with uh, your partner to try and find out you know if you're both going into the same direction or not Um so this pretty much resumes your um, your blockages for your uh, relationship for my dear friends Taurus 
um, if you do have any questions, you need some guidance in your personal relationship, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and uh, we'll be seeing each other just a little bit later on with another reading. I wish you a blissful day. Have uh, many, many joys and thank you for being there.